Hello, this is Shane R. Monroe with NVIDIA Shield Zone. I'm going to show you how to get split screen mode working with two NVIDIA Shield controllers on the NVIDIA Shield Android TV playing Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So uh, I'm not going to take you through how to set up game stream. I'm assuming you already have that set up yourself. So the first thing to do is launch Black Ops 3. As soon as you get the title screen, hold down the, uh, the uh, play button on the controller and uh, make sure you're selecting multiple controllers. Make sure both your controllers are already paired up before you do this. So I'm gonna hold down the play button and then I'm gonna run on over to these three dots. Multi-controller disabled, I'm gonna change it to enabled. Hit X and wait for the intro to be over because you can't skip it. All right, next up, get into the uh, main menu of the game Hold down the play button again until you get this menu. You'll get a mouse. Select activate split screen. Right now. There you go. Perfect. Now you can go ahead and get back out of that. And you can use it as normal. We'll just jump into multiplayer real quick. Do a custom game. And uh, you can see we're both up there. But now I'll prove to you that this actually works. My son will be controlling the other controller for Whee! a brief period of time. Hi there. I'm Brian. I'm nine. I'm not going to be shooting. Just moving around. Now you can see split screen is working great. No, just, just kidding, Brian. Hey. There you go. Bye. We'll just run around here for a minute so you can see we're not both doing the same controller. Or... Okay, my dad is moving right now on the top. I'm not moving. Now I'm moving. As you can see, um, well, yeah, this works. We're not moving at the same time, and we're not controlling each person, both the people with one controller. This is two people, right, Dad? Right, split screen play, just like we were hoping for. Okay, so that, that's, it. Yep, that's all it. how you so, do split uh, screen. Enjoy, and remember, visit NVIDIAShieldZone.com for all your Shield device needs. Next video will be in a while. I don't know what it's going to be about.